Yeah. Yes, Austria, please. Österreich, bitte. En er bleef nog lang onrustig in de stad. Ja. Austria. The second team, Belgium. Also in red. Zwart, geel, rood, Belgium. Be careful because it's a little bit risky upstairs. Wow, looks good, looks good. Wow. Okay, thank you very much, Belgium. The third team, France. Yes, please, the France team. <laughs> French. And they are. It's early for them. But also for us. It's early, but maybe you can look if it's afternoon, yeah? Okay. Wow. Okay, thank you very much. The team of Germany. Unsere wow. deutsche Freunde. Germany. The next team, Italy. 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 <laughs> the team of Italy. There they are. It's a big flag. Ah, it looks too good. Looks too good. 
Which goods? Team of Portugal. Is, uh, it's very simple. It's, uh, I would like to say three things. First of all, welcome. It's, uh, it's a big pleasure for us in the Netherlands um, at the Dutch Brother Federation to welcome you all here. Uh, we organized this event on a very short notice uh, with a very uh, small uh, budget with the help of uh, many volunteers and companies that support this little but uh, sport that is growing very fast and that we love so much. Um, so once again, uh, welcome here. The second thing that I would like to say is thank you. Um, because many of you left your families and this event cost you expenses and you left uh, your, uh, your work and you travel a lot to come here. And it makes us all very happy to see you here. And the last thing that I would like to say is thank you. Uh, congratulations. Congratulations to all of us. 
Congratulations to the Dutch Paddle Federation for organizing this. Congratulations to, to you for being here. And congratulations for, to Paddle. Because if our goal is to make the sport bigger, to make the sport bigger here in Holland, and it's getting bigger, uh, at this moment we have 20 clubs, and if things go well uh, in the coming two years we will go to 50. I know that in many of your countries, Paddle is becoming bigger. Paddle is becoming bigger in Europe and around the world, and for that, I would like to say congratulations because it's because of your effort that Padel is becoming bigger and bigger. Once again, thank you and welcome and have a great tournament. Thank you, thank you. Uh, today we are in, uh, in Rijswijk. Rijswijk is close to The Hague and I will introduce the major of Rijswijk. De heer Bezuijen. Thank you very much, sportsmen, sportswomen, coaches, family, also the, the chairman of the International Federation, Mr. Patti. Very welcome to the European Paddle Championships 2015 in the Netherlands, in uh, as already called municipality of, of Rijswijk. Uh, for, for the first time, uh, such an important uh, international event takes place in our country. And before I will uh, go on, I would like also to place these events, like all other events in the, uh, in the events that happened in Europe, uh, with the terrorism attacks also in, in Paris, uh, sports brings us together and also thinks, uh, thinks us about uh, why we are about, but it also gives us pleasure, but brings us together and to give some, some thoughts on people who are uh, involved. That I would like to ask for you just a moment of silence, please. Please all rise, that's best. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, as I already told you, this is the first time this international event takes place uh, outside of Spain. So that's for us a, a big uh, compliment to have you here. And we have uh, the first one here this week. Uh, and it's not without reason it's being held in the municipality of Rijswijk. It's already told near The Hague. Because the Netherlands Padel, and I almost have to, to pronounce it right, Padel Bond <laughs> Association has put a lot of effort uh, to get the European Championships in the Netherlands. Um, and I would like to thank them and the Pedal International Federation and all the volunteers and everyone who made this possible uh, to take this event place. And I would also like to thank uh, the Sports and Event Center La Playa for being a host uh, and for their support to make this event a success. Uh, there are, yes, They uh, recently opened their location, I was looking for you, but you were over there, very good, yes. Uh, their location recently opened in Rijswijk, and it's a special location because of uh, its four uh, inside parallel courts, which is unique in the Netherlands, and uh, well, you've already had the pleasure to play on the courts, but you will have the pleasure to play on these courts in the com upcoming days, so that's very nice. Um, at the beginning of my speech, I welcomed you to the event, but I would also like you to welcome to our city. And as a major of Rijswijk, I'm very proud that Rijswijk is the host for this exciting event. And for the next couple of days, Rijswijk will be your second home. At least I hope it will be. Um, and obviously you will enjoy the games, but don't forget to wander around in our old city centre, which is very nice. Especially on Saturday morning, when there's a nice market. I don't, know, I don't know if you have to play then, I don't know if I mess up the, the, the scheme, but um, it's a nice market with all kinds of food, clothing, flowers and much more, so visit it, it's very nice. Um, you can go outside, enjoy our parks uh, with a lot of estates, so don't stay inside, wander through our nice. There are also a lot of restaurants which you can enjoy as well, so I have done a lot of city marketing now, I think, so that's no problem. Thank you. But 
that's not the reason why you're here. Let's go back to the Bedell. That's why you're here. And I heard that Bedell, I didn't know that, but I heard that Bedell is the biggest upcoming sport in the Netherlands. I just asked the, the, the chairman how many people are playing Bedell, but I was surprised by the amount of people who are already playing Bedell uh, around the world. And it's an exciting mix of uh, tennis and squash, easier to learn, suitable for all ages, and always played by doubles, as I heard. I must admit that I've never played this game before, uh, which might not be the smartest thing to say in a place full of people who played Bedell, but, or have a strong connection to the sport, but from the sound of it, it sounds like an awesome sport which I should definitely, definitely try. So I will promise you, Marcel, I will come and play on your court. So that's... Uh, <laughs> Before I do that, I will watch one of the games so I can see how it works and what I should do. That's, that's the first thing I, I will do. As I heard, and we already seen that, that in total uh, there are 16 teams from 9 different countries competing in this uh, championship. Uh, 8 male and 8 female teams uh, will fight for the title. That's always nice to know. About 140 players with 15 trainers, their families, 12 sport presidents and many external visitors are there this week to enjoy the championship. And all of you, and that's good to hear, will help us with the promotion of the sport in general, but also the promotion of Padel in particular. A lot of kids, also in Rijswijk, uh, deal with overweight problems, so we are trying to promote sport and health as well. And sports like these can help them lose weight and to get to, into a healthier lifestyle. And all the games this week, as I heard, are open to everyone who is interested. And I hope lots of people will come and see the games, and I will try to promote that as well, and maybe even be inspired to play Bedell. And when you walk on the market Saturday, you can also ask people, you know, to visit the Bedell as well. So don't <laughs> hesitate to do that. Um, I was asked uh, to open the championships today officially, but I've already heard that I'm the first mayor who will open the championship, which already started, uh, because. I heard that you already played some games yesterday, uh, uh, so I don't know what the results were exactly, but I will hear that uh, I think later, but to make it officially, uh, I think uh, uh, we will open it in, in just a short minute. I will hope that you have a lot of success. Uh, you can't have all the success because there's always someone who has to win, so there might be some disappointed teams as well at this moment, which I don't know who they are, but I will learn about that later. But there's also one that has to win, but I think the most important thing to have in sports as well is the pleasure and the fact that you can compete on a, a good level without uh, it be, being that. I will um, give you all the good luck you have. Most uh, uh, important part of this sport is that you don't have wind, rain or other excuses you can use, you know, uh, in the game to uh, do that. So it's, it's all, all up to you, uh, or maybe the referee. I don't know how the referee can influence the, the game, but I don't know that as well. But everything is possible. I wish you all the luck. I would also wish you a lot of pleasure in our municipality. And last but least, that's the reason why I'm here. I pronounce the European Pedal Championships of 2015 open, and I wish you all the luck. Thank you very much. Thank you for your stimulating words. Thanks. Um, the microphone is at this moment for the president of the Federation Internationale Padel. I hope I pronounce it well. Daniel Patti. Thank you very much. Okay, dear government and sporting authorities, dear ladies and men players, coaches, referees, media, ladies and gentlemen attending the European Championships. It is a truly a great pleasure for me to officially, with the major of this uh, city, announce the opening of the ninth edition of the European Padel Team Championships in Rice by 2015. <laughs> It is the beginning of the new era of our maximum European competition because it tries to give continuity 
to the initiatives that were uh, repeated every two years. As we know, we thank to the work of all our affiliated nations, some in organizing and some other to their participation, since 1995, in which it was Italy that hosted the first edition, followed by Barcelona in Spain, Waterloo in Belgium, Sabadell in Spain again, Aix-en-Provence in France, Bologna, Italy again, and Portugal in Cascais 2009. Then we stopped two editions, and with the support of the Netherlands and Padel Bond, we start again. Thanks to the work of all people involved from our local affiliated national federation, and I'm asking you for an applause to the Netherlands and Padel Bond. It is a personal big thank you very much goes to Mr. Roberto Nesi and to Mr. Marcel Bogart for the shown organizational capacity as well as for all the kind and prepared staff. I also appreciate very much the media present with full coverage of this paddle event with qualified just-on-time interviews photographs, very nice videos, records, webcams for live streaming, beautiful graphic and presentation, and presence, thanks to all players and fans, also in all the social media. All signs of great event and commitment. These words are the formal act, but in the reality, as the Major said, the real inauguration started yesterday with every team player playing their first point. At that moment the pride to wear the own colors showed them in this instance that every player will record in their memory and bring back to their country. I was there in the Netherlands for the ninth edition of the European Pan Paddle Championships. For the event, is that the moment that all preparation was done over the last three, uh, few weeks? All of that organizational sacrifice and satisfaction is shown in the presence of all top players from male and female categories, from nine associate members, over 12 in Europe. That means 75% of our national teams, European national teams, are warranted the presence here. I could tell now that Harmony and Fair Play were the real winners and feel that every drop of sweat is justified for having participated in the ninth edition of one of the most important championships of the International Paddle Federation, which is the European Paddle Championships for national teams. Good paddle to all. Thank you very much. Yeah, the last part uh, of the program in uh, this theatre. Um, fair play is a word out of the player's declaration, and that's the last part of the program. Uh, please, uh, somebody of the Dutch team, I have the text of the player's declaration here, and one of each team, please. So somebody from Poland, somebody from Italy, somebody from Belgium, Austria, French, Germany, Italy, Portugal, Sweden and Switzerland. languages of course in English and in, in Spanish. One, one, one.
on behalf of all the players taking part in this European Battle Championship, we undertake to respect our opponents' fair play, accept the judges' decisions and to do our best for battle and the victor victory of our own teams. May the best teams win. Boss. Representación de todos los jugadores participantes en el Campeonato Europeo de Padel. Nos comprometemos a respetar a nuestros adversarios, a respetar las reglas del fair play, a aceptar las decisiones de los árbitros y a hacer todo lo mejor por el padel para la victoria de nuestros equipos, que el mejor equipo llegue a la victoria. Maybe now in Russian? <laughs> it was enough. Okay, thank you. Uh, what? Uh, all of you have a very, very good uh, tournament here in uh, Rijswijk. Nice days. See you later in La Playa. Uh, we have a meet and greet in the theater. And, uh, so you can uh, follow Mike to the other part. <laughs> Thank you. 